Iran seized a Portuguese container ship linked to an Israeli billionaire today. Iranian Revolutionary Guards boarded the vessel from a helicopter in the Strait of Hormuz. Previously, Iran has threatened to shut down this crucial shipping route. And this morning, the Israeli Defense Force struck a Hezbollah military post in southern Lebanon after the Iranian-backed group fired a barrage of missiles over northern Israel last night. Most of the missiles were intercepted. There were no injuries. We've been preparing for an attack from Iran for years, Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu said earlier. We are ready for any scenario. The big fear now is that this could significantly escalate the conflict, former Mossad official Sima Shine told us. Is this the most worried you've been? Yeah, I think this is the most worried. I think it's uh, on both sides, in Israel and in Iran. Um, and, uh, you know, at the end of the day, no one wants a full-scale regional war. Not even the threat of an attack by Iran could keep Israelis off the streets of Tel Aviv earlier tonight. Tens of thousands turned out to protest against Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu. Many demonstrators believe he will do anything to stay in power, including prolonging the war in Gaza and escalating a confrontation with Iran. I think he failed. He should go home. Deborah Pada, CBS News, Tel Aviv, Israel.